So in my previous video, we saw about the Quen 2.5 general purpose LLM. In this video, let's look at the Quen 2.5 math model, which specializes in mathematical problem solving. So they're saying that the world's leading open source mathematical LLMs is the open source 2.5 series of math models. So let's find out from this graph what they're claiming. So this is the benchmark that's set by Gemini Math Specialized 1.5 Pro model. And and the benchmark that's been set is 80.6 on the math benchmark. Quen 2.5 math with 72 billion instruction tuned model is now at 85.9. And also this is an open weight model versus the Gemini math specialized model, which is a closed source model. On top of that, they clearly mentioned that Quen 2.5 math mainly supports solving English and Chinese math problems through chain of thought and tool integrated reasoning so they clearly do not recommend using the model for any other task and what they're saying here is that this model Quen 2.5 math is basically an upgrade to the Quen 2 math model so how is this an upgrade so Quen 2 math series only supports chain of thought to solve english math problems while Quen 2.5 math series is expanded to support chain of thought and tool integration reasoning in order to solve both in Chinese and English and it has achieved significant performance improvement compared to Quen2 math series model and they have also given this plot where the x-axis is the number of parameters and the y-axis is again the performance on the math benchmark and top left should be our goal where we have less number of parameters at the same time we have very high accuracy we can see that the Quen series of models are just close to the top left and we have the other models like the Mr. Large Instruct on the right and DeepSeek and Llama 3.1 on the right which indicates that these models really need much more number of parameters in order to achieve the high accuracy that's currently achieved by Quen 2.5 math 1.5 billion instruct model for example or the 7 billion instruct model which is far lesser parameters compared to let's say Llama 3.1 405 billion parameters that's quite a lot compared to this just 7 billion parameters so they're given this figure to compare how they arrived at Quen 2.5 math model. They arrived at the model in three steps. As the first step, they took the Quen 2 math model, which is an instruction tune model, and they released it just a month ago. They released the first series of mathematical model, which is Quen 2 math in the Quen family. So this was a month back, and they used that to generate quite a lot of synthetic data for pre-training. And they didn't just use that synthetic data. On top of that, they gathered quite a lot of material in order to add to that data, for it, particularly in Chinese, from the web sources, from books and codes across multiple recall cycles. So they iteratively kind of grew a data set and they also expanded the number of tokens to 1 trillion. So previously it was 700 billion for the Quen2 model. Now they took it all the way to 1 trillion and they've created this Quen Math Corpus V2, which is the second version of the Math Corpus they are using to train this model. So with that data set, they took the Quen2.5 general purpose model and they just pre-trained it in order to arrive at Quen 2.5 math model. So they've taken this Quen 2.5 math model and evaluated it on three benchmarks, namely GSM 8K, math and MMLU STEM. So these are the standard data sets to evaluate on math task. We can see from these three columns, Quen 2.5 math models are winning in all of the three benchmarks. If you don't prefer the larger 72 billion parameter model, still the the 7 billion parameter seems to do a pretty decent job and maybe we can fall back to that. On top of the Quen 2.5 math model, they also introduce uh, instruction tuned models. So to arrive at the instruction tuned model, what they do is they train a math specific reward model, which they call Quen 2.5 math RM. And using this reward model, they construct a supervised fine tuned data set through projection sampling. And for the development of Quen 2.5 math instruct, an additional iteration is conducted using the uh, math instruct model. So to arrive at the Quen 2.5 math instruct, 
they do an additional iteration of the quen2 math instruct along with this reward model to polish the quality of the response that they are getting through the rejection sampling they arrive at the quen2.5 math instruct model this model they have extensively evaluated on several benchmarks these benchmarks include olympiad bench college math and gaokao and they've also benchmarked on challenging the latest data sets like ai me 2024. So if you look at the uh, performance of the uh, existing models on this AI ME 2024 benchmark, for example, Claude 3 Opus, GPT-4 Turbo, and Gemini 1.4 Pro managed to only solve one or two questions out of the 30 questions that are available in this data set. However, with the Quen 2.5 Math 72 billion instruction tuned parameter model is able to solve 13 questions. So when they switch to tool integrated reasoning mode, it is even able to perform better and it can get as good as 19 questions out of the 30 questions right, which is a great jump or great performance in such a challenging data set such as AI ME 2024 benchmark. So if you wish to try out the TAR mode of the model, then they have included a demo in the Quen Agent framework. So the Quen Agent framework is developed for LLM applications based on instruction following tool usage planning and memory capabilities of quen it also comes with example applications such as browser assistant code interpreter and custom assistant so they've clearly uh, shown here that they've added quen 2.5 math demo to showcase the tar capabilities of quen 2.5 model so to summarize they've introduced math 2.5 which features several key techniques they've extensively used synthesized mathematical data to upscale the Quen2 math model to Quen2.5 math and they have iterative generation of fine tuning data and reinforcement training to guide the reward model during the post training phase which is the instruction tuning phase and it also is now bilingual meaning that it can handle both English and Chinese problems uh, when it comes to mathematics. So as a result, Quen 2.5 Math represents the most advanced open source math model series to date. Now that's really great. Finally, they say that they hope to advance what they have made with specialized models like Quen 2.5 Math and will continue to strengthen the overall capabilities of Quen model and bring us closer to achieving artificial general intelligence. So if you want to try out a demo, there's also a hugging face demo that's provided by them. And you just have to upload an image and you have to sort of ask any of your questions and then it's going to give you the answer. So that pretty much wraps up our walkthrough of the Quen 2.5 math model. We saw how they have developed the Quen 2.5 model from the Quen 2 family of models. And we also saw how the performance reaches 85% with very less parameters compared to other models which have very high number of parameters. And we also saw how they started with the Quen 2.5 and then they pre-trained with data synthetically generated from the Quen 2 model and arrived at the Quen 2.5 model. We also saw some of the uh, evaluation metrics, how it fares against the other Quen 2 model and also the Llama 3.1 model. That pretty much wraps up our walkthrough of the Quen 2.5 math model. I hope that was useful and I will see you in my next video which is about the Quen 2.5 coder model and I hope that is useful to you as well. Until then I'm signing off. Take care.